I've been fortunate, and from a young age, I've always known that engineering was something that I wanted to go into. Um, I guess I really learned about Michigan Tech and started considering it when I was applying uh, my junior and senior year of high school. Um, I had picked Western Michigan, Kettering, and Michigan Tech. Um, I did a on-site tour of Kettering, and uh, I was pretty convinced about going to Kettering just because of the location and the co-op opportunities and all the extracurricular programs that they had to offer. But uh, my parents suggested, you know, you should really go visit one other school, you know, just to have some options. And I said, all right, sure, you know. And we went up to Michigan Tech, and I fell in love with the campus and found that they had a lot of the same different uh, kind of things to offer, um, and certainly at a more reasonable price too. So that was that was something that was important to me because uh, it's uh, Kettering is almost like a private kind of school. The rates are at least so. Um, yeah, I, I came up here, and one of the first things I, I said to my dad when we drove downtown uh, um, over the arch there, uh, they had that walkway, and I said, well, it's, it's almost like you're kind of, because it was the middle of winter, and uh, the kids were playing broomball at uh, 1 a.m. in the morning, and I said, it's almost like you're coming into a ski resort rather than a college, and he says, yeah, it kind of looks that way, <laughs> so, and uh, I'm an outdoorsy kind of person, so it just, it was a natural fit in, in engineering and mechanical engineering at that, and uh, uh, that this is where I, I belonged. I mean, it, it made me happy and made me smile. I guess you really can't ask for more than that uh, with what you're doing. So, um, but I guess it was just the overwhelming uh, feeling of uh, anticipation and, and confidence um, that I had made that. You know, that this is this was. I knew that that was what I wanted to do, but now I, I have confirmed that and uh, was just really excited for um, all the opportunities. And I couldn't wait to get up here and start. Uh, you know, have two or three different machine shops at my facility or at my disposal and uh, to take advantage of that. So um, I'd always, uh, my dad wasn't very um, hands-on. So when I got into uh, working on cars and uh, different things like that, I always had to teach myself. And to me, it was just another extension of that. Um, now I had taught myself the basics uh, with hand tools and whatever, but uh, now to have you know, CNC mills and lays and just to continue that process, you know, to teach yourself and it was uh, the next logical step, I guess, in addition to the, the coursework too, so.